guys what's going on it's your boy spam back at it for another youtube video and today we're doing another youtube video on the uh, volvo s60 um so yeah let's get in the car and have a look at it there you go. so uh yeah this volvo um what year is it scott please find the camera 2006 this is a 2006 volvo s60 so 163 brake horsepower from stocks to 2.4 and it's like a snail because it's so heavy. It's like two tons the car weighs. I'm pretty sure, but yeah, it's all right. Just a job. But yeah, let's go for a test drive. There you go. So yeah, this is, uh, like I said, 2.4 liter, the 5D engine. Uh, so it's diesel, TDI. Sounds sweet as a nut. Um, we do need to get handbrakes sorted out on this though. Needs adjusting. But yeah, let's take for a little speed on. So, quickish car. This the job. Perfect car if you're learning to drive. Pause way easy. This a job like a normal car does. I'll shut the window. There's less wind noise. But yeah, this car's only on 86,000 miles, but fuel economy, fuel economy on this car is pretty good to be fair. Um, so yeah, it's a nice chilled driving position. Right, put your foot down, it's pretty quick. Right, get just going. <clears throat> but like I said, it's only 163 brake, but it's pretty quick for 163 brake. So yeah, we're filming this like full four, four almost, it's almost five o'clock and we're filming a YouTube video. But yeah, it's cheap on the insurance because it passes as a granddad's car, so if you're 17 and pass your test, get a Volvo for the, uh, S60. It's cheap on insurance. They're quick, obviously. Right, let's put to the floor, picks up all right. Yeah, it's fucking beautiful, this car is. Turning circles are crap in this car, though. I've got to admit that, really bad. So, yeah, I could be showing you, there's a little lay bar I could show you in. We can stand some back roads, film in. But, yeah, turning circles, not the greatest thing in the car. If you're in a parking spot, it does take a while to get in there, but this is a big lay-by, so we turn around quite easy. So yeah, it's quite easy to turn around. Um, pulling away is quite nice, it's nice and smooth. But yeah, you can tell the turning circle is not very good, because I've got to go backwards now, just to make this three-point turn. I could have done it better, could have done it in one go, but you forget how wide the car is when you're driving it. But it is quick, it's second gear pull. It's a third. Oh, 60 more now already, it's fucking quick. And I just enjoy driving it. It's a saloon, so the boot is a pain in the ass to put crap in. But yeah. And some cars to drive. Right, it picks up alright. You can thrash it in the corners because I think it's got like, electronic expansion on my right, Scott? Uh, not on this model, it doesn't. Ah, uh, so I know on certain models you've got like sports mode and it's got like electronic suspension and all. Obviously, this one hasn't got it. But yeah, just pull away and quick. Got a million foot gear crews in there. Going into a gravelly car park. But as I said, all pull there. But I'm fourth gear, still pulling, still pulling. But yeah, it's an absent car to drive. But yeah, we'll go around and show you the uh, exterior and interior of the vehicle now. Let's park up handsomely. There's a puddle there, so I'll just park like this. And yeah, look at the uh, exterior and interior of the vehicle. So yeah, this Volvo uh, S60, um, this is the uh, rear end of it. Obviously, you've got the rear end of the car. Uh, you've got the tow it here for a caravan or a trailer. Quite good cost. I reckon you could pull a caravan all right. Um, you'd have the fuel cap on a lot of Volvos though. Um, uh, not really good. 
and I'm pretty sure you've got to like sometimes a wire break and you've got to open it from the boot but we'll show you the boot boots all right like it's quite narrow to put stuff in so if you like kidnap someone handcuff them put them in there they wouldn't fit but it's quite spacious in there you could possibly fit a dead person maybe not a fat one if you're gonna kidnap someone but yeah this is a job we kidnapped uh, a couple of sonics from the uh, arcade <laughs> our scott did but yeah this is a job uh we'll show you the uh, front end of the car now Look the so there's the front end, looks like an ending front end. With some Volvos you do get the uh, cleaners that clean your lights and wipers and all. And certain models of the C60, I've seen it on some. Uh, but we'll show you the engine now, what the engine looks like. So yeah, this is the uh, engine, it's a 2.2 litre 5D engine. Uh, your standard diesel engine, you've got your air filter there, your ECU, um, that's the engine obviously, main unit, but as you can tell it's quite a biggish engine, so yeah, this is a right job, but yeah, that's the engine, got your standard dipstick and all, washer fluids and all, but yeah, this is a job, easy to shut, like that, uh, we'll show you around the interior. So yeah, this is the interior, obviously we've got the rear passenger, uh, front passenger side. Alright, storage in the sides. It's got a little pocket, I don't know if you can see on the camera. In the front seat, nice little pocket so you can stash your drugs down there. Police wouldn't really know. Uh, we've got a nice little glove box, alright, size. Even though it's my mate's car, it's turned into my glove box. Um, the rear... Slide the seat forward actually. But yeah, the rear is actually right. Nice size, fit two fat people in there perfectly. Do have plenty of leg room. Uh, has got a seat in the middle, but it's really narrow. And even a skinny person like me can hardly fit in it. Found that out earlier. Got a nice little centre console thing, but yeah, let's go to the driver's side, the cockpit. So yeah, there's the cockpit, obviously you've got your main window controls, electric windows, uh, you've got keys obviously where they go, you've got your lights, main lights, lights off, I think that's fog, fog lights? Yeah. Your main lights, um, you've got your handbrake, your gear knob, so you can, when you're bored driving you've got something to play with, definitely you women drivers. Uh, we've got the radio, radio's alright, but yeah it's an Amazon car. So yeah, uh, if you want to feel cool, I know I'm not smoking a spliff for legal reasons of the videos, but you, you can have all the women in the back have a nice spliff on the go, you can just go for a nice cruise with them, show them what uh, fun is, but it's a nice car for cruising. This is a job. Gets the speed of right. Obviously. So yeah. Like right now I normally have a flip with my god, which I'm moving in the back. All over and all the time, which give them a good shag in. Let's get the land doing pretty well. But yeah, you can actually do the burn ups in this car, wheel spins and all, but we wouldn't do that because obviously legal reasons. Oh, there's a birdie in the road. <laughs> Horn marks, birdie moved. Oh, 
Jackson right as well. Fucking get to us. Get you right there, don't wanna hit it. It's got reversing sensors as well. There we go, we can see how close we are up. Guys, it's spam back at it. Thank you for watching today's video. We know it was shit. Big up my man Scott here for recording it. And yeah, I wouldn't recommend a Volvo. They're fucking shit.